A traditionally designed Pacific sailing canoe will soon be providing another means of transportation between the islands of the Marianas. The Okeanos Marianas arrived on Guam early yesterday morning. Imagine a sustainable, clean mode of transportation that could move people and cargo all throughout the Marianas without relying on gas, diesel, or any other type of fossil fuel. Well, the Chamorro people knew how to do this for thousands of years, and now it will soon become a reality once again thanks to the Okeanos Foundation. This foundation started a project in 2009 where they built eight 72-foot canoes called vacas or wakas in various Polynesian languages. In 2013, the Okeanos Foundation came up with the idea to build traditionally designed double-hulled Polynesian-style sailing canoes for inter-island sustainable sea transport. The main uh, focus and purpose of uh, Okeanos uh, uh, sustainable sea transport is to, to help remote islands and outer islands that are very hard in uh, delivering cargo and uh, we will use our walkers to deliver cargo and that's why we're going back to our old, uh, old ways of uh, sailing around around the uh, inter-island transporting goods and even uh, trans transporting passengers. Steve Tavaki is a sailor from Fiji who has been with the Okeanos Foundation for many years. Now he is training the crew and new captain of the Okeanos Marianas, a traditional vaca or waka made specifically for use in the Marianas. The canoe has proved its seaworthiness sailing thousands of miles to the Marianas all the way from New Zealand. This was built in New Zealand, so it took us 40 days from uh, New Zealand to Saipan and uh, we had stopped along the way around New Caledonia, Solomon and Truk and uh, now we just sail from Saipan to Rota and now we're here in Guam. A crew of nine people were on this 40-day trip from New Zealand aboard this amazing vessel. Our main generate is uh, wind you can see the, there's a rig here at the moment this is traditional rig and uh, we have engine on board that support us we have uh, our engine is a Volvo engine and it's running on coconut oil and diesel at the moment however the goal of their project is to run either on wind or coconut oil and reduce or eliminate completely the use of diesel and other fossil fuels the Okeanos Marianas is based off an old design but it was built with modern materials and technology in fact it even has solar panels to help power their electronic equipment used for navigation and communications. The canoe can hold up to 35 passengers for day trips and one day soon it will be bringing people all throughout the Marianas. Actually, this is Okeanos Marianas, so it's going to stay here. It's for the people of Marianas. It doesn't belong to the, the group that's running it, it belongs to all the people. Anyone can come, and, but there will be a certain group uh, occupied and running it, but vaca, this vaca belongs to everyone, belongs to the people of the Pacific. All right, and uh, after the new crew members are trained, the Okeanos Marianas should be ready to begin providing inter-island transportation in the Marianas in about six months. According to the website, the Okeanos Foundation is a community of international ocean navigators, scientists, cultural leaders, spiritual advisors, activists, and artists. Their vision is for a sustainable fossil fuel-free future built upon respect for traditional knowledge, environmental stewardship, biodiversity, and holistic place-based education and development strategies.